Our world has changed and is rapidly evolving. And during this change and transformation, we rely on our networks and relationships to help us overcome all the obstacles and challenges we face. Our strength is really in our people, in our staff, in those we serve, in our boards of directors, and even other nonprofits and their leadership teams. As we face more and more challenges in the months and years to come, our ability to partner and collaborate with others will dramatically increase our ability to sustain missions and achieve relevance that's better aligned to the future. Great leaders understand the importance of a strong network, meaningful relationships, and the ability to work together with organizations to form lasting partnerships. Let's hear from some of those leaders now. We are, we're, we're in the business of people, you know, and it is nothing short of amazing what people will do for their fellow human beings. I think it's all that we all have to hang in together. I think it's, it's and that's it. We, we, we are a small community that does an incredibly important job uh, because it is our job to take care of somebody else's loved one. I can see the folks we serve and they motivate you all the time. Heroes work here. Those staff um, rise to that challenge and figure out um, better, smarter, and more effective ways of doing things that um, they've been doing for years. But I've also been enormously um, just moved by the personal sacrifices that people are making to keep the individuals that we care about safe. Uh, the staff have been, of course, great, and our families have been great. Well, you know, obviously every single successful patient transport, you know, is awesome. Um, and the staff, staff has been awesome. You know, the remote workers, you know, working um, from home and keeping everything running behind the scenes has been awesome. Some people came forward to help. So there's always those bright, bright stars. And sometimes that's the way you keep your spirits up. You have to look for that opportunity. You have to look for that way to make things better. Because um, if you get just caught up in thinking about the crisis, you, you can't look beyond. We need to band and stay together. We need to be able to communicate with each other. We need to be able to talk, bounce ideas off each other, help each other out as best as possible. You need to have trusted relationships now prior to a disaster. As CEOs, we have leaned on each other for consultation and support, for practical support, for emotional support, for um, PPE sources. Um, there are a bunch of ways that we have come together. It's just all about collaborative. We are all in this together. 